Hello gamers, uh, we are going to play the next episode of The Walking Dead. Um, I've recently upgraded my graphics card, so it's going to look a little bit better than episode, the last episode. So, so we go to play. We uh, last left off on uh, Star for Help. We know how that ended, now we're going on a long road ahead. Hope you enjoy. I'm all wrapped up, that's what this is, because I'm absolutely freezing. It has been snowing this morning. I have a new can of Pepsi, and we're good to go. All I can just say is I uh, hope you watch and enjoy this. Um, subscribe, comment, like, do whatever you need to do. Previously on The Walking Dead. And enjoy. Get the gates open! We've got wounded! I want to know why you thought bringing more mouths to feed was a good idea. You've been good to me and my family. You saved Duck from those monsters. And you stood up to Larry at the drugstore. I won't forget that. No one's trying to cut you out of anything. Those look like the people who raided my Calm camp. Calm down, you're paranoid. Fuck you! Did you tell anyone out there who you were, or that you were tied to this place? That's right. I know who you are, and I know you're a killer. He's not dead! Somebody help me! Come on! We know this guy's not gonna make it! Jimmy! What the fuck? Sounds like a car. There's a shitload of food and supplies back here. You're right. We shouldn't take this. The rest of us are taking this stuff. Don't worry, little girl. Bandit's got their eye on that dairy. As long as they keep getting food from them, you'll be safe. And now, the conclusion of The Walking Dead. Like I said earlier, I hope you really enjoy this episode. This is, I've been playing this game, playing, and I'm really enjoying this. This game series adapts to the choices you make. The story is tailored to the way you do. Episode 3, Long Road Ahead. Looks like this is our lucky day. Maybe. Yeah, maybe. They tend to take us by surprise. Yeah, well, the less I see, the happier I am. About what? When it comes to the getting the hell out of Macon, I bet you're in the let's stay put camp, considering I've been pushing everyone to leave. Um, we should go. We should go. Motel's run its course, and it's not safe. Well, if that's what you think, you should probably fucking speak up. Lily's dug in. Everett's prescription. Oh, that's the drugstore. Man. Okay, just like last time. Over the rig, into the pharmacy, and scrape together whatever supplies are left. Why we didn't leave much in there. And we're out of options. Something's better than nothing. <laughs> Shit. Oh, you well okay? The ladder's come loose. I'm not sure how many more trips she's got in her. I'm not sure how many more trips we've got in us. No kidding. Kenny, you fat bastard, you broke the ladder. Okay. Right. As you know. That was a that was a drugstore from episode two, I think it was. Yeah, I think so, I can't remember. So, who knows? Hmm. 
Let's have a look at this car. Hmm. Looks like it still works. Okay. Push G. Um, doesn't really work. Oh, I know. A winch should work still. Lily's not doing so good, huh? Um, she'll be fine. She'll be fine. If you say so, you're the only one she seems to give a damn about anymore. Well, you and Clem. Woo, Clem! Or Clemmy or Clementine. Trailer to the axe. Uh, ignore that, my fine gone off just then. It's uh, an email. Nothing important. Let's put that on silent, really. Okay, let's run back over here. Uh, look at the winch control, which is just around the corner here, and. Boop. Perfect. I'm hoping the car moves. Are still upset with me for taking stuff out of that car last week? Um. I wouldn't blame him. What do you think? Christ. I've heard your opinion. What's done is done. I mean, they took the stuff out of the car, so I love you. Alright. Jump on the Jeep. Duck was asking about that guy at Herschel's farm last night. Really? I wasn't sure it phased him. Of course it did. It was a scary situation for him, Sean dying and all. I'm just worried he'll always think it was his fault. Kids, eh? Right. Give me your hand up. Sure, you up for this, Lee? I'm fine. I've got this. Give me your hand. <laughs> Shit! Ow! Bastard. Are you okay? Jesus. Are you okay? No, Dick, I'm shot. Now get off here. Do they? Jesus, I don't think so. Oh, shit. It's a girl. She's gonna get us killed. No shit. She's in bed. She's in bed. Fuck. I gotta shoot her. Put her out of this misery. You don't know we're here. What do you mean? I mean, we leave her alive and she draws them all to her. Buying us time. Yeah, think about it. We're always worrying about the ones we can't see. She stays alive and brings them all out of their holes. You're probably thinking, why I did that? But I would rather be put out of misery. Move. Is he gonna be able to lift me up this time? Good. Shut the damn door. Fuck! Incoming! Come on, Lee! Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, go, go. Hard. I see. It's oh, dirty I see. as hell, but we ain't got much time. Get everything you can out of these racks. Don't forget underneath the counter this time. I'll clear down here and then we gotta go. <laughs> oh yeah, I'm super strong mate. Right, let's grab that. 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 Out of time. Yeah, we're out of time. Fuck! 
coming. Come on, Lee. Okay. Up and over. Still clear. Let's hustle. Shit. <laughs> Is this cheating? He's my bad. Oh, he's, he's thinking about it. If he leaves me here, I'm gonna go nuts. <laughs> Can't believe you can. Can't believe you. Bridge, bridge. That's a good idea. Let's fucking get out. Right, let's go. Come on. Oh shit. Get off me. Come on. No, 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 Hey! Oh, there. Stay there. <laughs> okay, that ain't good. What the fuck was that? They're everywhere. You took care of yourself, didn't you? I can't believe it. I honestly can't believe you almost left me there. Man, we have been under attack a lot. Look at all those arrows. Ben's a lookout. Clem's over there. Talking on the radio, having a pretend talk, probably. You're back. Ben found some stickers in a drawer, and I put them on my walkie. Hey, sweet pea. That's neat. I'll find you in a minute. Looks like we got the kid on watch again. What'd you get? We might as well leave a sign out that says the men are gone. Come and rape our women and children. So, what did you get? A lot, lot of stuff. We're fine, by the way. Nice work. This will keep us going. If we carry on like this, we'll get through the winter here. The winter? We'll freeze our asses off here! Because piling into an RV with you, after what you did to my dad, is so appealing. Why wouldn't it be? You know I'll do what it takes to keep everyone safe. We're already safe. We do whatever is best for the kids. Doesn't that make sense? It's suicide out there. We'll die in here. You're right. You could see someone sleeping and kill one of us. So, you two are, uh, having a disagreement? Cool it, Doug. Don't boss people around. I'm sorry. We're strongest together. I know you think I'm on her side, but there are no sides, damn it. What about the food situation? What about protection? What about when this place falls? Somebody's got to be thinking about this shit. How has this not been working? We have everything we need. Because of me, Lily. No, because Lee knows how to take care of people, not just things. We got plenty of food from that station wagon. Yeah, no thanks to you. You didn't even want to take it. Where the hell would we be now? We can't just keep our fingers crossed for more station wagons. Everything that happens to us is another excuse for you to pull this crap about leaving. All I want is a week of peace, of not hearing it. We wouldn't even be fighting about our medicine and supply stocks if Lee hadn't fucked up downtown. What do you mean? Some girl came screaming out of an alley. She had dead hanging all over her. She was making enough noise that we would have had plenty of time to get what we needed. Instead, smart guy shot her. He what? He put her out of her misery. I couldn't let her suffer. I couldn't let her suffer. We're all suffering. Some more than others. We've been putting our lives on the line doing these runs into the city. You wouldn't believe the shit we see. We all appreciate it, Ken. Look, Macon and its people aren't savable. It's not a town. It's full of walkers. And the people who were left are dying and wandering out onto the streets. It's hell on Earth. And it's coming. This way. It's not going to be easier out on the road! How would you know? What I know? I know you're not above murder. I know somebody has been stealing our supplies, 
That's right, stealing! And I know the list of people I can trust here gets smaller every day! That's not really many people, now Everybody eh? get out! Lauti fucking down. She'll get over it. She'll get over it. She's riling everybody up otherwise. You understand, Ken. All I know is, whenever this shit happens, I'm the fucking bad guy. I'd like a thank you for once. Thanks. For once! Thanks, Kenny. You have a good one. Miss you. Bye, catcher. I think your name is. Uh, rough day, I guess. Yes, Doc. Yeah, I've just been calling them days lately. I don't know what it is, but it's probably worth talking to Lily about things going missing. Ever mm. since her dad died, she's been a live wire. And now, if she's paranoid, that's a bad mix. Ah, <sighs> dear. Right. Let's go talk to Lily again. Let's annoy Lily some more. Lillian! I had to click it three times. Click, click, click. Oh, God. She is a bit of a screw. I'm sorry. You don't have to apologize. Did you come in here to give me hell or to coddle me? I think you're coming unhinged. I know. I'm trying. I'm trying. I just... I feel like a crazy person. Can I do anything for you? Yes. I need help. There's yeah, we all know that. Somebody, one of us, out there. He or she or they have been taking things. For, for real? Who? Oh, what do you got? Yes, for real. And I don't have shit. I just know. Lily. Counts off and it's the good stuff. Antibiotics, oxy, fuck, anything with opium in it. I see the count and it's fine. I keep my own. That one's getting messed with. I'm a fucking mess right now, but I'm not stupid. I know what happens if I start a witch hunt. So you want me to start one? I want you to poke around. Poke around. What's there to go on? I found this tossed into the garbage. Hmm. Huh. We don't toss out equipment, we fix it. You'd only try to get rid of a flashlight if you were using it when you shouldn't. It's just a few things. It's not a big deal. Bullshit, it's not. You know it is. And I'd really appreciate the help. Hmm. A mystery. <laughs> Jesus, Doc. I'm sorry. Um, I heard you guys talking. You need to unhear all of that. Can I help? Pardon me? What did I just say? You're the Grace Detective, and I can be Dick Grayson. Your ward. That's Robin. I know who it is. <laughs> Fine, you're Robin. Okay, you're Robin. Yes. What do I do? <laughs> I, I don't know. Go look around. Let me know if you find anything weird. I'm on the case. Flashlight. Broken flashlight. <sighs> Duck will help. Better than nothing, eh? Oh, that's a dead end. You can't go down that way, apparently. Apparently, I've been in New York. How are you doing, Benji? Let's have a look around. Da -da -da. There's nothing more exciting around here. Ah. Uh, oh. There's some broken glass on the ground there. It's just hmm. It's broken glass on the ground. <sighs> da da da. Dug 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 dig dug dig dug. Has anyone actually seen that yet? I mean, ever since I mentioned it. No. Let's uh, show Kenny a flashlight. Do you guys know anything about this broken flashlight? Fuck. We don't got many of those. Yeah, it's a problem. The glass and the bulb are all busted out. I saw some broken glass over by the ice machine. I meant to clean it up before the kids hurt themselves on it. I forgot, though. Well, clean it up now, then. 
Get off your fat ass and do it. I shouldn't really say that. The Benji. flashlight was broken. Was it you? No. You're not in trouble if it was. I know you get nervous and maybe you went out to go to the bathroom, broke it, got worried and tossed it. What's with the third degree? I didn't break any flashlight. Okay then. Hey, Doug. Hiya. Do you know anything about this flashlight? Well, I can tell Ooh, you... Wait, 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 wait. I know you know everything about this flashlight. <laughs> I'm asking if you know how it got busted. Lily found it in the dumpster. Oh, no. No, I don't. Well, I'll keep my eye out for some suitable parts, though. That'll give me something useful to do. Sounds like Kenny actually has that thing running. I'll Ooh. believe it when I see it. Now... You know, he's... It's something... Let's inspect the broken glass. Make sure it's... Yeah, it fits perfect. Oh! <gasps> Did anyone else see that? There's something drawn there. Seriously. Hmm. Chalk. Pink. Hmm. Dark. <laughs> A clue. Maybe. What do you think it is? Well, it's a. I X. don't think it's anything. Maybe it's a sign. It could be. It's pink chalk, which is weird. Okay, back to investigating. <laughs> Clem. Yeah, she's got chalk, hasn't she? She's a kid, she likes drawing, as you can tell, so we're gonna wander over and talk to Clem, Clem, Clemmy. Do you think Clem done it though? Hello, Clem, Clem. Hey, Clementine. Hey, Lee. What's, What's that you're working on, Clem? It's called a leaf rubbing. My teacher, Miss Moore, showed us how to do them when we went to the botanical garden once. See, it's the same. Um, kind of. Oh, that's really something. I'll make one for you, too. Yay! Do, uh, you have any pink chalk? No, it's gone somewhere. Hmm. Do you want blue? No, no, it's okay. Psst, Lee. <laughs> Inspect the duck. something. What is it? I found this piece of pink chalk and a scuff of it over by the gate. Really? Totally. I was coming to see him for clues Yeah, and... Duck, I got it. Good job. Alright, might as well. Cool! I if he you knows. didn't break the flashlight, did you, Duck? No, Mom and Dad won't let me touch any of their stuff. Lily neither. That's probably for the best. <laughs> Alright, let's have a look at this then. Scuff chalk. Somebody was over here too. See? I did good, huh? Yeah, Duck. You did. I suppose I should go out there and look around. You stay here this time. Seriously. Okay. So a bit wound up. I have a gun, so I'm happy. If I get in trouble, boom, boom. I may not actually have the walkers, but I don't know. Let's uh, look close to this side here. Hello. <laughs> Hello. We have found a bag. It's a bag or something. Well, no shit, Sherlock. It's a bitch. You don't think that's what Lily was going on about? You haven't come up with anything, have you? I came up with this. It's got a bunch of meds in it. It was in a grate on the outside wall. And there's a sign on the other one. Holy fuck. Yeah. 
Okay, we line everybody up. Everybody. Somebody is killing us. Stealing from that supply is the same as slipping into your room at night and cutting your throat while you sleep. You die. What is the difference? What if Clementine gets sick and we don't have what we need? What the hell? You don't fucking steal from us! Who the fuck is that? Yo, We've got our people out there! Out here. We ain't fucking around! What Holy do we do? Shit! Oh, Lily. shit. They're gonna start kicking in doors any second. Lily, what the hell are you- Stall them. What? Just keep them talking. Do whatever it takes to stop him pulling the trigger. Right. You made Stole the biggest him. mistake of your life! <sighs> shit. Enough of this bullshit! Drew, stop putting your boot to these doors! Yeah! Hold it, asshole! Take it easy. Why are you doing this? Just leave us the fuck alone! Why? This fucking guy. Why? Because we gotta! That's why! What will it take to reach a deal? About twice as much as you've been giving us. You got it. Done. Is that so? Giving us. Well, I suppose we ought to hash out some terms then. I don't like no hash. Man, shut up! Crash! Oh shit! Run, run, move, get out of the way, go! <gasps> nice one, Dad. He's got a gun there. Nice shot. Look, the headshot there. Come on, stick together. Come on. Come on. Oh. Missed. Gotcha. Now, get over here. Hurry. Get inside. Get your ass in there. Um, let me catch up. Catch up. Hang on. Oh yeah. Any more? Miss. Stick it up. Come on. There you go. Cut. Hurry! Come on! Hello, sir. Get inside the RV. It's gonna be okay. Go! No, 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 no. Oh Christ! That's quick off the draw on that one. Lily, get in the RV! Screw her! Let her stay! Please, walkers! Kitty, hurry up with that thing! Watch the right! Please, left! Come on, Lily. Shit. Yes. Woo! Cat, Jesus, are you okay? I'm fine. I'm fine. Oh shit! Oh shit! Oh shit! I'm sorry. Calm down. We need to figure out why this happened. Why is he Nobody sorry? died. We're okay, right? Katya, you're okay? We just lost everything. But we have our health! Cat's head is split open! I'm fine. Somebody in here caused this. Settle down back there. The bandits have had our number for weeks. This is different. Somebody was working with them. Whoever it was was slipping them our meds. They didn't get their last package, so they attacked. Calm down back there! That's nuts! Lee found a bag of supplies hidden outside the wall. It's true. So, Ben. I think we need to talk. Whoa, what? Lily, let's think about this logically, no? Logically? 
the new guy who could have easily been a plant? I think that's pretty logical, Doug. You think I'd do anything to hurt you guys? Don't play dumb. Were you hoping they'd eventually kill us all and you could join them? No one's at fault. No one is selling us out. Then how do you explain what you found? I don't know. Somebody did this, Lee. I didn't do it. Really honest. I know I don't get wrapped up in the politics around here, but we really need to think before we start stringing somebody up. Doug, I appreciate your concern, but we have all the evidence we need. Doug's right. Let's just get on down the road. We can talk this out like adults. Why give someone who almost killed us the opportunity? Lee, you know what we found. Just let me out of the car. I'll go. I didn't do it, but I'll go. Good. That sounds great. Lily, look at him. I... Fuck. Jesus, I didn't. Look me in the eyes and tell me you didn't have anything to do with it. I... Shit! What's going on up there? I hit something. We gotta stop. Alright, well, we can deal with this now then. Kitty, is it safe? Should be. Everybody out. Lily. Out. Why would you get out of the RV middle of the night, middle of nowhere? Seriously. I know he's got to go out to clear the zombie, but. Kenny, the RV has some surface damage, but there's a walker trapped underneath. God damn it. Everyone keep your eyes peeled. You know what? We shouldn't just kick you out. We should hear what everybody thinks. I think you should chill out. Please, look, it wasn't me. Please stop accusing me. I'm really sorry you're upset, Ben. Just tell us you did it. I'm not doing this. Come on, Lee. You're the one who found them. You can't just abstain. Fuck all that. This is nuts. We're out here on the side of the road. Okay, fine then. Kenny? I don't know. Fuck. Just stop, would you? Well, your vote counts for you and Katja. We don't need all these votes. What do I have to do for you to trust me? I'll do anything. I'll, I'll do watches for months. Ha, the hell you will. I'll get more food, more medicine, anything. He's broken, Lily. I can see that. Do we need any more evidence than this? Evidence or not, this hey, isn't any evidence. way to treat one of us. I've heard enough out of you, okay, Doug? What? Kenny, what's it gonna be? Just give me a damn minute. Ben, you have until Kenny kills that walker to tell me it was you. No! Ben! Lily! Lily. Lay off. Lay off. I can't leave. You know I Please can't. Please stop. Please don't kick me out of the group. We won't. Tell me. Now. No! Please, let's just get back in That's the not happening! I can't handle this! There! I got him! Now, what the fuck's the problem? What the no. fuck? Doug! Oh my god. You bitch. Drop it! What's happening? Keep duck away from the windows. Jesus Christ. Get in. We're leaving this crazy bitch. I didn't mean to. It wasn't supposed to be him. You're not coming with us. He's not coming with us. I'll die out here. I don't care. You're a murderer, Lily. We can't have you with us. I'm a murderer? You've had Lee with you this whole time. What are you talking about? He didn't tell you. He killed someone before all of this. He was a convicted murderer. Is that true, Lee? Yeah. Yes. Fucking hell. Were you ever gonna get around to telling me that? You got a little girl with you. To hell with it. Get in, Lee. Let's go, you guys. I don't have anything left. You're staying. I can't believe she almost shot Ben. But she killed Doug. Fuck. 
fucking hole. That was hard. Better start running, bitch. Lee, a word, please. Pacha needs you for something. Alright. What's up? Is Duck feeling alright? Fuck. What the fuck? You've been bitten. Happened during the raid. What's the plan? We've never had a bite victim in the group before. I'm going to keep an eye on him and see what I can do from a medical perspective. We keep the same plan unless something changes. East. Guys. What else is there to do? We thought you should know. Not that you've ever afforded us that type of luxury. Anyway, if you could tell Clementine, we would appreciate it. I think she likes down. I'm, I'm glad, glad I have you. Me too. I heard you outside my treehouse that day and thought about dropping a hammer on your head. <laughs> That's nice. <laughs> That's nice. I didn't, though. Thanks. <laughs> Doug's gone. Uh, ah. Hey, 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 Clem! Get off of me! Hey, Clem! God. We got something up ahead. Fuck it was. Is there any way to get around it? Doesn't look like it. On foot, maybe. Can't really afford to do that now. This seems like a safe area. All this brush will stop anything from creeping up on us. Why don't you and I go look around? Yeah, everyone else relax. Clem, stay close to Kenny and Cat, okay? Lee, if you come across anything to drink, uh, if there's a dining car or something, I think Duck's a bit dehydrated. It's a freighter, hon. Be careful in there. What? You think there might be something dangerous inside an abandoned locomotive? That would cross my mind. <laughs> right. Alright, let's have a look. Actually, I want to see how Ben's doing. What would 
would you have done with Lily? I don't know. Left her? I've never seen anybody kill someone like that before. Yeah, you've seen a bunch of other stuff by now. Yeah, but not like that. You, uh, happy you stayed with us all this time? Yeah. Really? It's with you guys or dead. I would have died out there in the woods. Just like my classmates. You think this is better? Yeah, of course. Was it you? Not this again. Was it? No! Okay, then. Okay. That's fine. Let's have a look in the, um, box off stuff with... Hey, Ben! Somebody's been living in here. Yeah, man. Shit, think they're gone? I Probably. Hope so. But this looks recently used. Be on the lookout and have your guard up. That's the map. We'll take them. If we take the map, just in case. So it's useful, that is. Map of where the train goes. I think these tracks might lead to the coast. Ooh, 27. Savannah. Bacon to Savannah. That's where Kenny's got us headed. Pardon me. Ah, water. I'll take this to Kanja for Doc. Time to jump out there. Hmm. Ooh. It's all locked in place and seats. Okay. Well, I know a little bit about trains. Um, don't ask me how I know about trains. I just do. Um, but kind of give you an idea. Just trying to decouple that. There's normally something in what do you call it in this carriage here. I mean these engine blocks. Uh, that Might one. be something inside. Nope. I thought if that was if that was first time, I was gonna say, oh yeah. Apparently not. Okay. Next one. That one. Oh, hello. Okay, we've got a monkey wrench, a spanner. And a spike remover. That could be useful. Right, so let's see if we can um, see if we can decouple this train, shall we? Now, what do I get now? All I'm going to do is get back up again. I uh, could give catch of the water. I'll do that and then I'll pop out next. Jump down. Run around. It's stuck. I can definitely pry this thing free. If I can break it loose first. Shit. Hmm. Broken. Maybe not. Well, let's give um, Kaja the Wolf's Earth a duck, anyway. So the map was again. This in the boxcar back there. Whoa, is this what it looks like? I think so. These tracks lead right to Savannah. Holy hell. Can you guys see about moving that thing? We could have something here. Yeah, mm -hmm. we're on it. Here, found some water. Oh, thank you. Perfect. He's allergic to bees. Is that right? That's all I can keep thinking about. Like, somehow that matters. It doesn't. I know. Well, I don't. But you're probably right. Okay, let's have a look inside. Oh, 
Ella Cutley in there. Nine. Nothing. Did I just see what I thought was all in that carriage as a zombie or something? And here, see? Shit. We got one. Walker, sitting in the chair. We got him. Take him out nice and quietly. Suppose we ought to look him over. Yeah. Hmm. I don't think this guy came back. No. Christ. That light is blinking. Push it. Push it? Why not? Are you fucking serious? Here, look. <laughs> Hello. It's just the brakes. Okay, I'll give you that one. This fucker works? Seems like it. I'll be damned. How the hell do we get it moving? I don't know. That's Mr. Amtrak over here. No clue. Well, let's look around. <laughs> Maybe it goes somewhere we'd like to be. Man, if you could keep an eye on the girls and duck, I'd appreciate it. I'm gonna make sense of these controls. Well, he's a bit pissed off about that. Man, this could be exactly what we need. Really? A bunch of maps about Georgia's cities. Nothing about the train. Hello? Shit, this is it. Instructions on starting the engine. Damn, pages are gone. I can kind of see the indentations from the writing. Oh. Lovely. Mm. Oh, there's numbers on there. I have no idea what to do with these. Okay, maybe not. Hang on. Shit, this is it. Instructions on starting the engine. Damn, pages are gone. I can kind of see the indentations from the writing. Indentations on the writing. Find a way to read a notepad. <gasps> Clem, with the with the leaf. Just had an idea. If I speak to Clem, do 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 do. How are you all doing? Jump down. Run around. Clementine. There's a notepad on the train. Do you have any pencils or anything in your pack? No, I wish. Maybe in the RV. What do you need it for? There used to be something written on the notepad that I need to know about. Well, if you're not using it, I'd take it. I'm out of paper, and there's all sorts of new leaves around here. Aww. <laughs> Aww, all sorts of new pretty leaves. Open the RV door. Let us in. Right. If I had pens, I'll be there. It's a weird way of grabbing the pen. I'm surprised he didn't spike himself. Oh, I can't get out. Okay. That was weak. As I'm walking back towards there. Up the stairs. Well, not stairs, but you know me. Hmm. Let's have a go, shall we? Perfect. You can read it now? Yeah. Should be able to just follow the steps to get the engine on. Sounds good. Awesome. Okay, six down, down, up, up, 
up, down, up. Down, down, up, 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 down, up. Okay. No! Why'd I go out? Ah, oh, no, Lee, you... Why do I... Back in there. Down, down, up, 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 down, up. Right, I'll be number six. Right. Use console. Okay, so it's... Down, down, up. 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 Down, then up. Son of a bitch! Whatever you did, lit the dash up! So far, oh, so yeah. good. Okay, now we need to check the notepads. I need to go back. Use console notepad. Five is that and up. Right, five is that and up. No, wrong one. That and up. So, that and up. Now we're talking. Now, number nine, I saw it out there. That's it, right. It's left and right. Left. Right. Holy shit! We're golden! Duck what about the duck? What about it? Look, Kitty, it's something we're gonna have to deal with. Did you not hear cat? We don't know shit, Lee. Let's fucking enjoy this. Mom, let's see if she'll move. Okay. Maybe that might dislodge the, um, that pin. Because... It's all yours. The... Oh, shit. Um, look how That's the throttle. I'm so glad. Damn it. We're still attached. Can you go find out where we're stuck? Get us unstuck? Yeah. Sure. Leave it to me. Do, 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 do. There we go, use that probably the couple of bin. Look at that. There. Hey Kenny, we're loose. Da, da, da. You touch any of my stuff? Oh. Shit. Outside? Yeah. And the guy up in the cab. Him too. I saw you walking through here and thought about scaring the pants off you. What? But I couldn't force myself to do it. <laughs> You're still kind of freaking me out. Train folk will do that. Already met everyone outside. They all warmed to me right quick in direct sunlight. <laughs> Indirect sunlight? It's a bit like me. You have to be in direct sunlight to meet me. You met Chuck? Yeah, I did. It's so nice to meet someone normal for a change. He gave us candy, Ben too. <laughs> His face. You have candy? You have candy. Boy got the last piece you got on me. Figures. <laughs> you met Kenny? 
Sure did. Man shares my love of the road. That's for certain. <coughs> I'm awful sorry your son's not feeling good. I appreciate your concern. Well, with a little TLC, I'm sure he'll be fit as a fiddle in no time. And I can offer y'all whatever I got, although it ain't much. Thank you. We'd like to do the same. Why don't we hold off on that? Stay with us. We'd like the company. Okay. Anyway, uh, sorry, I just mean just in the lights up. So that's it? We're cut loose? Seems yeah. that way, yeah. Great. We don't got much left, so just gather whatever you have. Let's go. Wanna ride? Well, it sounds like you're taking my home. That's a yes, then. And find anything better for keeping the creepy crawlies out than that boxcar. Well, you got the RV. Duck's sick. Get on the train, Clementine. Oh. So I know she's getting sicker. Let me look at him. We can keep going if you want. Damn right I won't. That's what we're doing. I think Lee just wants to talk it through. It's talked through. You know, Captain. I'll be up front. I don't want to hear any nonsense until we get where we're going. Oh, damn. This guy. We're on the move. We're on the move. He's a bit armless. Get it? Armless? You gotta be hard on you, eh? Three adults taking care of three kids. No disrespect, son. More of us. Dad, get him. No. No. Ah, living got him. Lee. Lee, I need you right now. I need you to go get him. What's up? Would you get that off his face? My hands are full here. Okay. Sure. Thank you. Could you just get that off his face, please? He's out of time. We need to stop this train. Okay. Please. Okay. I do not want to fall. Look at those trains! I like trains! Whoa! Stop the train. Got to need to, Kitty. Duck will be fine. 
sorry. I shouldn't talk like that right now. Go back there and tell my wife everything will be fine. What is the goddamn deal? He's a little sick, but we can't just quit. It's a scratch. He's not like the others. Jesus, all y'all are just making it worse. He's been bitten. This isn't about Doug. It's not about my son dying. What the hell do you know? You're not my friend! I don't hate you. You sure as shit haven't done anything for me. How many sons are you gonna let die? Shut your mouth! Just leave me the fuck alone! I don't need you, and Duck doesn't need you! I told Kaja I'd get you to stop this, and you bet your ass I'm gonna. We don't get along. I'm not letting you do this to Cat and Duck. You want to hurt people because you're afraid. Losing Duck ain't enough for you. Because you're fucking lose everything acting like this. I'll fucking kill you before I let that happen. The boy's been bit, in case you haven't figured that out. Take as long as you need. There ain't no time left to take. Kenny, what are we gonna do? We can't allow him to become one of those things. But what if... what if he doesn't? Kenny, I love you very much. I love our son more than life itself. I need you to hear me. What you are saying, that he may not turn, is foolish. But... No. There's... Come on, Cat. If you think of one, you let me know. Isn't there some sort of pill or something we can just give him? Stop it. Just drift off to sleep. Right, hon? I mean, Jesus, this is our son. I know. But we know it's... Here, or nothing. Oh, fuck. Just who, then? You want me to? You don't have to. I'll do it. No, you don't have to. God, just should do it, Ken. She can handle it. Shut up, Lee. He's right. No, honey, stay with me. Your son loves you, and you should remember him as the silly boy we used to have. Not this. Yeah. Look, Clint. 
Things are... No. God! People die. People die. Not anymore. The walkers aren't dead. People don't die anymore. Well, Katja made you a duck dead. I know. I'm gonna go get her. She's probably a mess. Yeah. yeah. Get Clementine on the train, all right? And keep your eyes open. God, I feel so sorry for Kenny. I mean, he's lost his son. I can't even think to imagine what he's going through right now. I mean, to lose someone that you love that close to you is it's painful enough, but if it's your own son... <laughs> no. Cat! Cat! Gotcha! Oh, no, and he's still, still alive. Why? Cat! Honey! Fucking God! <laughs> I'm so sorry. She couldn't. She, she, she just. Fuck. Oh, oh, fuck! Poor bugger. He's lost Kaja and he's losing Duck. Killed herself, but she didn't feel dark. What do we do? Put him out of his misery. You're his dad. You gotta do this. Just put him into it, man. He's gone. It'll be okay. It'll be okay. It'll be okay. <sighs> Poor bugger. Poor bugger. I can't imagine what he's going through. He's not hey, happy. how you doing? I don't care what reason you had for doing it. No reason to go and tell my girl she's gonna end up dead. Of course she is. I don't know much about you folks, but I can tell you as sure as the sun's gonna come up tomorrow. Y'all keep going on like this, and that girl ain't gonna make it. What do you know? I know that you don't have a goddamn plan. We get to Savannah, and then what? 
we find that boat. Do you think that's a new idea? You got even the foggiest idea about where you're gonna find one of those. Look, sit down with the girl and hash it out. Find a map, for Christ's sake. I'd give you one if I had it. And if something were to happen to you... It won't. If it were, you gotta prepare the girl. Teach her to use a weapon, and for crime, and he cut that hair. She's, She's a little, a little girl. girl. And she'll die a little girl if you treat her like one. You gotta consider her a living person. That's it. You're either living or you're not. You ain't little, you ain't a girl, you ain't a boy. You ain't strong or smart. You're alive. Look at her hair. You got her running around with a mop that's gonna act like Velcro to any hand swinging its way. Find some scissors in my pack and take care of that hair before a walker does it for you. And then show her how to use a gun. Because like it or not, that's what saves your life from here on out. I don't mean to tell you how to do your job. But too many people have died already. They have. And seeing another little girl die might just do me in. I hear you. A plan, a haircut, and a gun. It's good advice. It's something. Oh, best... Okay, guys, this is the best line I've ever heard on this game. I, I've been told about this. Where are you headed? Uh, that way. I mean when we get to Savannah. <laughs> we got a few ideas. We'll have a talk when we get there about whether or not you folks want company. See, uh, they had, uh, Be safe that way. You betcha. Okay, let's talk to Clem, shall we? Let's just talk to Kenny. Hey. It'll be good to get to the water. Yeah. What about I my past? I to talk to you about keeping my past from you all. Doesn't matter a lick to me. Fuck. Just gotta move forward. Bastard. What's up with hey, him? Ben. Hey. Aren't many of us left? Yeah. You, me, and Kenny. Clementine. The homeless dude if he sticks around. Are you gonna be able to step up? I can do just as much as anyone else. Good. Also, I hope that's true. Doug saved your life, you know. I know, I know. I don't know if I can go on like this, man. Well, you're gonna. That's just the way it is. See you. Yeah. Well, something's eating him. Take the bottle of whiskey actually. Keep away from the enemy. Means I can give it to the guy at the front there. It's a fifth of whiskey. Scissors. They look clean enough. Okay, so hey, let's sit talk to Clem. Did you talk to him? I did. He had some, uh. He explained himself and made some good points. Look. I'm not gonna let anything bad happen to you, but there are some precautions we have to take. Okay, yeah, that makes sense. Don't worry, sweetheart. Okay, well, what should we do? Well, we're gonna figure out a plan for when we get to Savannah. Teach you how to protect yourself and uh, tidy up a little, so you can't get grabbed so easily. I'd like that. Good. You need to know how to protect yourself. Like hiding or running away? Got it. I mean with one of these. First, don't be afraid of it. It's just a thing. Take it. But know where your finger is all the time. And don't put it on the trigger unless you want to hurt somebody. Okay. Okay. See? It's not scary. It's heavy. You'll get stronger. To aim, you look right down the top, through that notch. Line up the sight at the end with your target. Is there anything else I should know? Um, uh, uh. Squeeze, squeeze the trigger. trigger. Steadily, okay? No, you don't just squeeze. Yeah, you do squeeze. 
steady. I can do that. Every time. It'll be ben tough. Drums. Just remember to do that. You'll hit what you're aiming at. Okay. I'm ready. So I'll just kind of get the arms bent as well and aim for the trigger. Good. Don't lock your elbows. Okay. Let's take your first shot. Squeeze the trigger smoothly and I'll cover your ears. Nice and easy. Nice oh. and easy. <laughs> oh. You okay? Oh my hands hurt. I don't like this. Let's stick with it, okay? Do I have to? Yes. Yeah. To the right. You do. Now. Bit to the right. Close. Keep it steady. I got it. Excellent. Good shot. I like how, you know, that she's shooting towards the TVs. Right, I need to go up. Steady now. Almost got it. Okay, a little higher. There we go. There you go. Nice. One more for good luck. See, LCD, uh, premium LCD displays. She's shooting into a box on LCD displays. Well, it's not like there's any electricity around anymore, is there? So... I did it! Yeah, you did. Good job. I squeezed the trigger, just like you said. I know. You did good. They're not walkers, though. No, far from it. But you know how these things work now. We'll graduate you to walkers one day. Okay. I feel good. Not so scary, huh? Nuh-uh. Okay. Hi. Let's cut a hair. So you're probably not gonna like this. Oh no. What happened? Nothing. We have to talk about your hair. It's not safe. That's not nice. <laughs> what? Are you saying it smells? No. Because it does. Kinda. Do you remember when Andy St. John grabbed it and I got mad? Yeah. Well, that could happen again, and if it's a walker, well, we need to trim it. Just a trim, right? Yes. I need to cut it short enough so that it can't get grabbed. <sighs> okay. Well, and if we do this now? I guess not. Don't mope. It's a good thing. I'm now going to become a hairdresser. Do you? Do this? Nope. <laughs> nope. Nope. No idea. I'm not much of a stylist, you know. I'm going to look like a boy. <laughs> but think how much safer you'll be. I'd rather be dead. Shush now. So you did kill someone before. Yeah. You could have just told me. I wouldn't I have been afraid of you or anything. Sorry. You've killed lots of things now. It doesn't even matter. Killing is bad no matter what. But you do it now to protect yourself. And mm -hmm. to protect me. Doesn't make it good. But you have to. I do it because it's necessary. Walkers aren't people. Okay. I think I'm about done. I can probably tear these pieces back with something. Here, I have some hair thingies. You do? Uh, yeah. Lily gave them to me for sleeping. Yeah, all set. No. Dumb. <laughs> no, you look cute and a lot harder to grab. Actually, she does look better with a hair on that. Hope we're not on this train much longer.
Hey, Ben. Right. Hey. See you. Yeah. Hey, Ben. See ya. He just, he's like poking and poking and poking. Maps up here? I don't know. I just uh, want to look over one with Clem so she has a lay of the land once we get to Savannah. Mind if I get by you for a second, Kenny? Can you just leave me alone? Okay. Pass up. Well, yeah, he's, he has lost his wife and his son, so. Okay. I found this if you want it. Damn. Didn't realize I had it left. Thank you. Want a nip? Mm, nah, I'm nah, fine. I'm fine. Shoot yourself. Pardon me. I'll try to have a nip as well. Mm. Anybody in there want to share a drink? You let them know. Will do. I'm sure Kenny could do with a drink. Chuck wanted to know if you needed a drink. He's got some. Yeah. Yeah, that'd help. Right, let's grab a map from the map bin. Let's go see Clementine again. Thanks. Oh, that was a quick drink. That was a very quick drink. It was like... Must have been just a swig. Why? Go, 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 went back in. Alright. There's something hey, not yeah. right, Ben. Hey! See ya! See ya. Yeah, something not right there. It was me. Huh? Huh? I was the one giving the bandits supplies. <gasps> what? It's all my fault. Why? What for? Why the hell would you do this? They said they had my friend, that he was with them. By the time I realized they didn't, it was too late. They said they'd kill me, kill all of us. I'm sorry, Lee. You still want to talk to me? Yes. Yeah, I do. I'm real sorry. Let's drop it for now, okay? See you. Yeah. Ah, oh dear. Let's show the map to Clementine. Let's get a plan in place. Hey, Clem. Hi. I want to talk about Savannah. Me too. And what we're gonna do when we get there. We don't know what to expect. The city could be bad or totally under control. The thing is, you and I, we're a team, you know? And a team needs a plan. Aside from everyone else, when this train stops, you and I should know exactly what we're doing. A plan. I like it. <laughs> the plan. Good. I think we should look for your parents. Really? Yeah. yeah. You need to know if they're okay. Well, if they're not, what happened to them? I'm sure they're okay. Don't get your hopes up. Let's look at the map. If we can figure out where they were, we can start there. Okay, let's. Looks like we'll come right through town if there's nothing on the tracks to hold us up. Now we've got a good chunk of Savannah here. What do you think? They always stay in the same place when they go there. It's, uh... Hmm. Hey, don't worry. We'll figure it out. Have you ever been there? Once. Well, think about it. There are a lot of hotels on here, but read this map and maybe it'll jog your memory. They've got really tasty desserts. It's called mm. the M... M... something... Mar... Is this it? The Marsh House? Yes, that's it! So we'll head there. Yes! You think we have a good plan? I think it's very good. Can I... Tell my parents, you know. 
sure. Sure. Go ahead. All right. How do you feel? Good. Better. I'm glad we have a plan. And you're a good little chef. Thanks. I guess we should see how far... Oh, shit! Hold on, everybody! <laughs> and there's Chuck still in the front there. Nice little pitch framing. Holy shit. Fuck, 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 fuck! Maybe we could walk? That's fucking stupid, Ben. I'm just saying. Hmm, I don't know. I ain't got much experience with y'all's fortitude, but we could probably deal with that. We got a goddamn train. That thing's not full of milk, Charles. That's gas or diesel. Something that's gonna explode. You gotta get a hold of yourself. This a crew here. This ain't shit. This. Yo! You keep screaming like that and you're gonna get your face chewed off. Are you guys gonna be trouble? Because we could have just kept walking. Um, Define trouble. Define trouble. Anything that gets you killed, or worse. It tends to come hand in hand with groups of guys in distress. Let's give these guys a break. We'll see. You guys got a problem with your train? Yeah, you're standing right in front of it. Dude, <laughs> it's a wreck. It's not so bad from up here. Send your buddy up to have a look. Anything goes sideways up there. We won't let them escape. Okay. Climb up the ladder, climb Fuck, up the ladder. come up there. You better not be murderers or thieves. I guess you'll have to find out. A group of guys is what we need. They're what you think we need. We're doing fine. For now. What about when... Stop it. Hey, dude. I'm Omid. Lee. Krista. What's the deal with the train? We're Lee driving. Krista. Oh, man. Look, you some good you want to help us out? We could use some able bodies and yeah, we we really need some help. What's in it? Oh shit! God damn, you guys have a kid! Hello. What are you doing up here? Do you know how long it's been since I've seen a kid? Shit! What's your name? Clementine. Oh, so he gets to swear. Well, this <laughs> is great. See? Things are looking up. You're not her dad. He down there? It's that obvious? To me. <laughs> and no, he's not down there. Huh. What's your story? I came across Clementine alone. First day all of this happened. I was actually incarcerated. Sick. Do you have any prison tats? I uh, didn't make it that far. And everybody down there, they're cool? Um. Can I? Kenny lost his wife and kid. Man, how long ago? What time is it? Uh, I don't know, uh, four? Maybe two hours ago. God damn. We're sorry for anything that's happened to you guys. A train is awesome, though. A tank is your real problem. We'll help you with it, but if we see anything we don't like, we're moving on down the road. Alone. We'd appreciate the help. You can't just blast through it, I guess? If you could get it down, the rest would probably be pretty easy. We'll start there. We'll come down and settle in and see if we can help. See what's in there. Put on those two Cones, tape. I'll take the tape that's because that's the only useful different. thing in here. Okay. The generator. See if I can use the hitch. There's no way I'm pulling anything apart down there. Okay. Let's go down. Guys, this is old Mead and Krista. Not big on welcomes. Like I said, we could use some good people. We just wanted to say hi and say your train is pretty cool. 
The plan is to cut that tanker down and be on our way. Seems like plan enough to me. You want to start in on that tanker? I'll get to know the girl for a minute, if you don't mind. And why don't I show you how this thing works, in case something happens. Really, Ken? It's probably for the best. Someone might want to have a look inside of that station back there, too. Sounds great. Let's do this thing. I'm going to go have a look at the station then. Who's... That must be... What's his name? Walk to the station! Can I follow you over there? You don't like the new girl? I do, but it's like we're a team, like you said. Yeah. Oh yeah, fist right. bump. Come on. Clementine and I are checking out this train station, all right? Hustle over if you hear anything. Do, 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 do. Everton's survivors inside. <sighs> Dear. Somebody must have been pretty desperate. I bet. It's paint cans, signs, no entry signs. Let's get down from there. Dum, da dum, ba dum. No entry signs. You should wait for me before trying to open doors. Sorry. Uh, luckily, it's locked. We'll get better at working together. Fist bump. High five. <coughs> mm, won't burn. The window's open up there. Maybe I could look in? Why don't I put you on my shoulders and you can peek into that window up there? Sounds good. Go on. <coughs> up. Hang in there, Clarence. Okay, I can see in. What do I do now? Uh, getting this door open is going to be tough. It might not be that hard. Maybe we can find the key or figure out a way to knock this door down. Kenny'd probably have me pick the lock, which actually might work now that we have the time. I think I opened it. For real? I think so. Hey! Well, I'll be damned. Let's go. Be careful. I'm supposed to tell you that. It's a bit dark in there. I'm a bit anxious because you got that survivor's yeah, son. Damn, it's dark in here. Maybe I can hold the door open? I don't like that. I'll prop it open with something. It's too dark in there. Yeah. We should prop the door open with something. I'll have to use my thing, won't I? Let's go back in there. We'll prop the door open with that thing I'm holding. So it's way too dark. Yeah, yes, we know, Clem. There we go. Job done. Oh dear. Ooh, it's blue torch down there. That's exactly what we need. Over there? Yeah. We need to get in there and get that blow torch. Locked up good. There's some space up there, but not much. We're lucky I'm so little. Here we are. Come here, Clemmy. Put you in there. You okay going over the top of this fence? Yeah, definitely. <laughs> up and over. Go on and grab the keys, Clem. Come on, scoot. Behind you! Oh, shit. Fuck! Spike mover. Spike mover. 
Ah, no tienes. Ey. It's okay, it's okay. It's okay. Everything's fine. Jeez, now! Fuck, it's still locked! Oh, fuck my shit, eh? That one. That was close. God damn. That didn't go so good. <sighs> it did not go so good. But we're okay. Everything's okay. What's going on? I thought I heard a gunshot. We're fine. We found some walkers. You and an eight-year-old versus three of them, huh? Yep. We're that awesome. We handled, we handled it. it. Yeah, it looks like. What if you hadn't? I'm gonna go make sure the noise didn't cause us any problems. That's a good idea. I thought you could turn out to be another Lily there. I hope oh. you know what you're doing with her. We're still alive, aren't we? Yeah, oh, you are. Just got a ray torch. We got it. Well, let's go outside now. What did we learn? I'm not ready for a gun. No. You just have to learn to pull the trigger. It's so hard. Don't think. Just, just do it. Do it. Live with what happens. I'll squeeze. try. You squeeze the trigger. Little tip for you: if you use the firearms, your and your and your elbows, so you're not locking them. You squeeze the trigger. You don't pull it because if you pull it, you know you, it's got recoil. If you squeeze it, it's going to be a lot better. I found a blowtorch in the station. Should make quick work of the coupling up there. Excellent. I'll come up there with you to have a look. There's a leak in it. Turn it off, dude. I, I don't want my eyebrows burned off. <laughs> Better plug that leak with something. The tape. That tape we picked up. I knew it was going to come useful. Hope there's holes. There we go. That's crazy. Look at it go. Just about got it. Whoa, thanks. No sweat, man. This thing is hanging by a thread. The smallest cut and it'll go. Here, <laughs> the weak portion of the coupling's out of my reach. You think it'll be within mine? <laughs> no, but I'm gonna dangle you over that ledge. The hell you are? Hey, you didn't have much of a son of a bitch, aren't you? Shut up and start cutting. <laughs> Cut! 
Can he go? Shit! What the hell do we do now? We gotta jump! What? No way! Jump! No! Jump, damn it! Still no! Fine! Well, look, it's Savannah. I'm hoping it's Savannah. At least that cotton on this cheek's getting better. And look, Clementine's asleep. Oh, 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 Dark. Next stop, the Atlantic. Yeah. We're finding Clementine's parents when we get there. I thought they were dead. Looking for them there. That's not the plan. Well, it's ours. She and I talked it through. You'll be all right. I'll be alive, I guess. Blood in my heart. Blood in my brain, at least. Yeah. I'll leave you to your thoughts. She's out cold like I've never seen. Right? That fucking thing was broken. So did I. Who the fuck was that? If he's convinced Clementine that he has her parents, y'all might want to rethink your plan. Oh, God. Almost hit the river. You want to get on a boat? You want to wait around till the walkers figure out we're here? I know I promised that we'd find your parents. But Savannah's more dangerous than I thought it would be. I don't know how much longer he can keep on like this. If his leg gets any worse, we're gonna have to carry him. Or leave him. If I were you, I'd get out of the street. Now! Who the hell is this? Answer me, damn it! So when were you going to tell us about the radio? Who have you been talking to? You come back here, I'll kill you. You understand? I will kill you! 